Hello friends, let's make a fun 4th of July treat. We're making my favorite cheesecake mousse stars. Everything that I'm showing you here is from the sugar art, including this gorgeous star mold and these acrylic sticks. Um, how gorgeous are these? They are so perfect for this treat. So we're starting off with my creamy, dreamy vanilla bean cheesecake mousse base. I've popped it into this piping bag here. Also, the quality of these bags and bag clips, guys, A1, go get them. Now I'm going to go ahead and just snip the tip off of that bag, and we're filling our mold. I like to do one layer of mousse, get that stick in there, and then top it off with a little more mousse. So we're almost sandwiching that stick in there. Then I like to grab an offset spatula, smooth that cheese cheesecake so you have a nice smooth surface it is nice to have a smooth star on both you know ends the front of course and the back these pop out beautifully once they're frozen overnight look at that gorgeous star guys i can't get enough all right here we have the star of our show our chalk elites in white ruby red and blue sky these are so dreamy, guys. They're perfect for coloring chocolate. I'm making my high-quality white chocolate slightly whiter here by adding some white. Look at that. It just takes all that yellow away. Let's go ahead and dip our stars. Look at that perfect coating. Oh my gosh, guys. So pretty. Now let's turn that white into red. I've added in ruby red. I'm just going to mix that into my chocolate. And you see a little goes a long way here, guys. Look at that gorgeous shade of ruby red. I'm simply obsessed with it. We're going to dip a couple of stars in that. Look at that gorgeous opaque color. I love the Chalk Elites, guys. I cannot stress that enough. Here I've got a small bowl and I'm going to go ahead and add in some of my blue sky. This is blue that we'll be using to marble some of our um, moussicles. So we've got this gorgeous blue here. I'm swirling it into my white, but I'm not going to stir it. I'm just going to go ahead and dip my star right in and you get the most gorgeous gradient marble look. I have to show you this again because I simply can't get enough of this shade of blue combined with the white and that marble that we get is absolutely stunning. Now we're going to turn this mug of blue marble into a nice opaque blue. So I've added in a little more and we have this gorgeous sky blue shade. It is simply perfect for 4th of July celebrations. We're going to dip in a couple of stars and we have this gorgeous shade. Guys, the Chalky Leeds make my life so easy when it comes to coloring chocolate. I'm using my excess chocolate here to drizzle onto this white star. We've got some red and blue. This looks like the American flag. I love it. And then we're doing some monochromatic action on these red ones with a little bit of a drizzle. Same thing for our blue ones. I just love the texture that this adds. And there you have it, guys. So pretty. All these moussicles look so, so good. But of course, they're not complete without some gold diamond dust. So I'm going in with some gold diamond dust. Look at that. Oh my gosh. I could watch this forever. I love it. Gold diamond dust. Diamond dust in general makes everything better, guys. And there you have it. A super easy, super fun, and very, very festive 4th of July treat. I really, really hope you guys loved this. Like for more and let me know what you think of my cheesecake musicals.